Item number, SCP-494, Object Class, Safe. Special Containment Procedures. SCP-494 does not require any special containment procedures, other than being kept under lock and key in storage bunker at site. Level 2 clearance and written permission from a level 4 or higher researcher is required for testing procedures regarding SCP-494. Description. SCP-494 appears to be a regular pair of black leather fingerless gloves. SCP-494's anomalous features can only be observed while worn by a human subject. Upon being fitted onto the hand, SCP-494 will change size to match that of its wearer. Test subjects have described the feeling of wearing the gloves as if they were, quote, not wearing gloves at all, end quote. SCP-494's true anomalous nature is revealed in that when an object is held in each gloved hand, after exactly five minutes, the two objects' makeup will be suddenly traded. The range of materials that can be transferred as yet seems to have no limit, and has been observed to create working machines and even living organisms from the materials provided. See test log for details. SCP-494 seems to have some limitations such as the fact that only objects that can be supported by the wearer's strength, artificial assistance, such as leaning one's hands against a wall or table, seems to negate the effects of the gloves, will be transformed, and for reasons unknown, the gloves will refuse to work when worn by a subject over the age of 60. Testing Log Test 494-1 Materials Right Hand 1.24 carat diamond. Left hand. One regular golf ball. Result. Right hand. One diamond shaped piece of plastic. Left hand. One rounded crystal formation, two inches in diameter. Diffractometry confirms monocrystalline diamond. Test 494 2. Materials. Right hand. One Nokia flip cover cellular phone. Left hand. Two stainless steel razor blades. Result. Right hand. One hinged stainless steel box with acid etched surfaces denoting a cell phone keypad. Left hand. Two millimeter thick machines with small screens and microscopic computer circuitry found to be fully functional as cellular phones. Test 494-3 Materials Right hand One white laboratory rat Left hand One 1974 penny Result Right hand One copper statuette of a rat Left hand One small disc-shaped organism with white fur Though lacking sensory organs or any observed lungs or digestive system Organism is entirely viable and responds to external stimuli such as light and pain. Test 494-4 Materials Right hand One vial containing live streptococcus bacteria Left hand One white laboratory rat Result Right hand One vial containing animal cells with DNA of rat Left hand no observable difference aside from a slight change in the hue of the animal's fur. However, after further observation, the resulting animal proved to be capable of asexual reproduction. It proceeded to give birth to 77 young within an hour, without any indication of stopping. Resulting offspring grew rapidly, maturing within a half hour. Mature offspring in turn produced their own offspring. All animals were subsequently incinerated. Estimations of rate of reproduction suggest over 100,000 young would have been produced within a day. Note: All tests involving the effects of SCP-494 on live microorganisms are now strictly prohibited. Addendum 494-1 Suggestions for testing the effects of SCP-494 on SCP-500 in conjunction with other materials are currently pending approval. Lesson complete. If you missed the previous orientation, 
Go watch SCP-493, Replicant, right now. Or for the complete course, watch this playlist.